So, you've got an Android flagship that's running a flashy Android Nougat, you're most likely looking forward for the next big software update to find its way to your device. At the moment, that it be Android 8.0 Oreo, the latest major version of Google's OS that's a bit incremental in its feature and improvement set. As humble as it might be, it's definitely something to look out for, especially for those Android fans that like living on the technological edge. So, when are you getting Oreo on your device? It might sound rather cruel, but the waiting for an Android update to arrive is like dancing for rain, it's basically beyond you and there's little to nothing you can do that could change the outcome. Yet, judging by past experiences, it's somewhat easy to guesstimate and come up with believable predictions as to when the most popular smartphones of the current year will likely be threaded to the Oreo treatment. Galaxy S8 and Galaxy S8 Plus, no info yet, but judging from our past experience, Android O should roll out to the unlocked handsets in early January to February 2018. Carrier-specific version of the flagships should get it sometime in February to March 2018 due to the fact that carrier updates take significantly longer to receive the latest updates. Galaxy Note 8, sadly, the Note 8 did not feature Android Oreo right out of the box, but are certain that it wouldn't take Samsung long to update its latest flagship beast. We are probably set for a late 2017 or early 2018 Oreo release for the Note 8 though we don't have any recent trends to back this up with thanks to the Note 7 debacle. Yet, the Note 5 got treated to Android Marshmallow back in March to April 2016, which sounds quite disappointing. We hope Note 8 don't need to wait so much longer for the latest of Android. Galaxy S7, Galaxy S7 Edge, the X flagships are on the back burner when it comes to software updates because they are near the end of the road of their software support. They started with Marshmallow on board, received Nougat early this year, and will most likely receive Oreo in spring 2018. Galaxy S6, Galaxy S6 Edge Galaxy S6 Edge Plus, neither of these devices should expect Oreo to hit them, at least officially, because they're past their software update window. LG V30, there's a high chance the LG V30 will be updated to Oreo earlier than LG's other flagships given that it's the hottest new stock on the company's shelves. No word yet on a potential time window, but we are hopeful that LG would deliver by the end of this year. As usual. We expect South Korean V30s to receive Oreo first, with a wider release a week or two later, this applies to all LG high-end devices. LG G6, as long as the G6 is concerned, a prediction is really hard to come up with. Last year's G5 was all over the place as it first began receiving Android Nougat on its Sprint version in mid-November 2016, whereas the unlocked US version began receiving in mid-May 2017. Thus, the G6 is likely facing a similar release, carrier versions of the flagship will most likely roll out their updates first, likely in November to December, but the unlocked version of the phone might get stranded on the back burner. LG V20, the LG V20 has been running Android Nougat ever since it got launched over a year ago, and there's really no telling when it's getting updated to Oreo. Logic suggests that the V30 and the G6 should get it first, with the V20 being no telling when the manly phoblet is getting treated to Android O, but this is probably happening sometime in late 2017 or early 2018. LG G5, Oreo will be the last major software update to officially hit the modular experiment that was the LG G5. Seeing that it received Android Nougat in mid-May 2017, its owners are probably facing yet another one-year wait before they get a taste of that crunchy Oreo. Moto Z2 Force Edition, Motorola has already stated that the Moto Z2 will be among the devices to receive Android Oreo starting sometime this fall. While no exact time window was given, we really hope that it takes place this year and users of the handset wouldn't need to wait till 2018 to receive the update. Moto Z2 Play this device is also slated to receive Android Oreo starting this fall, though we suppose it will be on the back burner in favor of the Z2 Force Edition. HTC U11, 
HTC has the habit of trying really hard to update its latest flagship phones to the newest Android version within 90 days of the final Gold Master release. The HTC 10, for example, really did receive Android Nougat within 90 days of release back in the day, which makes us think that the U11 will reiterate this successful as Oreo got released August 21, thus, the HTC U11 is a likely candidate to get Android O in late 2017. HTC U Ultra HTC also said that right after its U11 gets updated to Oreo, the HTC U Ultra will be patiently waiting next in line. Essentially, this means that U Ultra users will likely need to wait just a bit longer than their HTC 10 flaunting mates. HTC 10 Android Oreo will be the last official software update for HTC's 2016 flagship device, which means that HTC likely won't rush the update, so don't expect it in the following months. The HTC 10 predecessor, the 1M9, began receiving its Swansong update to Android Nougat in early spring 2017, so logic suggests that the HTC 10 will begin receiving its Oreo update early next year. Sony's Perian XZ1, XZ1 Compact, the Perian XZ1 launched with Android Oreo out of the box. So if you have pre-ordered one of these, rest assured that it will arrive with the latest software in store. Sony's Perian XZ family, word on the street is Sony's X flagship phone will be receiving Android O in late 2017, possibly in late November, early December. The predecessor of the Perian XZ family, the Zperian XZ, got updated to last year's Android version in late November 2016, so there's that. Hopefully, Sony delivers earlier this year. Huawei Mate 9, according to rumors, Oreo is slated to arrive on the Mate 9 soon, which is a pleasant surprise given that Huawei is not known for fast updates. Huawei P10, launched with Nougat out of the box. The Huawei P10 will most likely receive Oreo sometime in 2018. Why? Well, simply put, Huawei is not popular for quick software updates because its devices run the rather heavy EMUI interface which is tedious to update with all the new features and improvements Google has ousted. Huawei P9 The Huawei P9 received Nougat in March 2017, which is not good news for the Oreo update, if anything. It tells us not to wait for Oreo to land any time soon. It will likely arrive in spring 2018 as well, though there's no explicit confirmation that it will receive Oreo at all although it will be well within the two-year software update window. What are your expectations concerning Android 8.0 Oreo? If your device is not in the list or you think some information are wrong, don't hesitate to let us know in comments. To discover more Android-related content, don't hesitate to subscribe to the S. Sorrels channel.